A very good morning to all of you at City Life. We're just praying and trusting that you are having an amazing meeting and that Jesus is speaking to you, not during worship only, but also during the word that's coming straight after this and also the connection that you have straight after the meeting with each other. I wanted to take this opportunity just to say well done to all of those that have engaged in such an amazing way over these last couple of weeks as we've focused just this wonderful truth of living life on purpose for God. God has been doing amazing things and connecting people, but I want to remind you that uh, the whole idea behind this was to focus people on Easter weekend, which is happening next weekend. And so what we've want to do next Friday is put together a short message 10 to 15 minutes put it on Facebook and YouTube and then encourage all of you to find a couple of people friends or family and either connect with them via zoom or whatsapp or even have them in your home on Friday morning 8 a.m. as you listen to that message and then break bread and pray together straight after that I think it's a great opportunity for us to connect with our families and friends over Friday as we remember the great price that Jesus paid for us. Then, of course, the Sunday, we're going to celebrate together 9 a.m. here at the venue. And that'll be a great opportunity for you to bring uh, friends and families to the meeting. We, of course, have downstairs and upstairs available. So whatever the restrictions may be, we'll have enough space um, just to host those that come on that Sunday. And I'm looking forward to just preaching the gospel and trusting God for, for people to be born again as they hear that incredible good news of the Lord Jesus Christ. And then quickly, lastly, I wanted just to remind you that it's been a year now since the lockdown started. And if you can remember the last Sunday before it started, we actually here at City Life had a sign up Sunday where people were putting their hands up to commit to serve in different teams here at the building, Sunday mornings with children, with music and with setup, etc. And so it's been a challenging time for us, but I feel that we've pioneered those different areas and that it's time for us again to begin to build those teams. And so we're looking for people who want to be involved. I think it's one of the greatest gifts the local church gives us in this discipleship process, and that is to serve with others on a team. Not just when we're on duty, but to, to build a team that can minister and serve Jesus Christ together. So if you've been on any form of ministry team, we're going to get in touch with you over the next week or two. And if you're keen for the very first time to get involved in any of those areas, please let us know and we'll give you the information on how we're going to do this and build those ministry teams into the future. We pray you guys have an amazing time as you listen to the word and we so look forward to next weekend as we celebrate our great King Jesus and all that he's done through the cross and through his resurrection and ascension. God bless you. Take care.